I can't believe that it's already here. I can't believe that it's been nine months of absolute mayhem and I'm just proud, just proud. There was craziness everywhere just happening all over the place. My poor apartment smelled like a barn for a good month because we had actual sheep skin, like not the skin itself, but just the wool. It looked like a sheep laying on the ground and we had to break it apart and comb out dirt and hay and poop. The music was, uh, we wanted some instrumental, something dark, something sexy, and we didn't really want uh, the same beats that you'd normally see at a fashion show. So. It was a collaboration between myself and the fashion director, and uh, you know, he's, he definitely has a major, so he's British, so he has a big you know, English influence. We, we collaborate really well together. I'm shocked this is a professional show. The amount of staging, and it's a professional, real show that, that this, this school mounts. It's extraordinary, totally extraordinary. They do things big here in San Francisco. <laughs> Not falling is one of my main uh, priorities. You know, making sure your walk is smooth and even, kind of like you're just flowing, making the clothes look hot. The thing I really like about the school is that they've always had a very, very, very creative vision and their students are just remarkable. And you can tell that the students are a reflection of the staff. We were doing things like wrapping fabrics, wrapping them with stuff in them and boiling them and then putting them in the oven with between bricks. I've seen the collection that I'm wearing tonight and it's amazing. Um, one of my favorite pieces is a skirt that I'm wearing that's kind of got a diagonal hem. It's low cut. It's beautiful. It's called Street Gang. I guess it's supposed to be a little edgy. It's good, it's kind of creepy. Cornell, Dartmouth, and Pennsylvania. I would say Europe. I would want to describe it as European. It's very sexy, very original. Beautiful people, a lot of young, energetic stuff. Very nice, very glamorous, very, I guess, very San Francisco. My diploma is now in coma, my son. Well, it brings the excitement, youth, and new talent, absolutely. We're so lucky to have this school in town. It's very, like, art. It's There's the big jackets that are very constructed, and my last outfit's a gown, and it's beautiful. It's gorgeous. It's you never it is a great event for San Francisco, and I love what the kids put out. The individuality. I think San Francisco fashion shows a lot more individuality than other places. It's fantastic here. I thought it was wonderful. I mean, the students are really talented, and there was such a diverse array of aesthetics, which is exciting to see. I was wowed by every collection. Just incredible. Uh, I thought the clothes spoke just volumes about chic, sophistication and really uh, the incorporation of tweed and knitwear, it really was right up my boat. They just, they bring such an energy and a life and the shows are really professional. All the students have such great um, world skills when they're done for the industry. And so, you know, it's become a huge event. It's original, it's unique, it's timely, it's gorgeous. The, that young boy who did that Gazar sculpted thing, extraordinary the kids from the way they drape and the way they work the fabric just really very special the students are getting an opportunity of a lifetime two of them are going to go work with Ralph Rucci who's just absolutely sets the standards in clothes and I'm so proud of them and I'm so glad that this university can can provide those opportunities for our fashion students oh, that's Lee, hi, me, hi, step to it. there's lots of to it near me